Hey guys, welcome back. One of the last videos. As you can see, I hooked up the computer. Um, this is with a, a special cable you can order online. It's an, an OBD2 cable, this one. Uh, it comes with 16 pins. And yeah, you can just order it online, it says here, OBD2. And yeah, that you can use with the, the program Tune ECU. And um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. If I can hook up the bike. Um, and also, I'm just gonna measure out the output on the battery. It's just a quick measurement. And then I'm gonna reset uh, and set first manually the throttle body. So you have to remove the air box for that. Um, and then put the tank on some wooden blocks. As you can see, I think. Yeah, you can see here as well. And put some light on there. So you can, uh, you can arrange it. You have to re make a readout with this and then do some uh, resets. Um, and I'm just gonna work you guys through this. Um, so the reset adaptation and resetting the total position and then make a procedure so the mapping is uploaded. And then I can basically start working on a test ride. I've also been working on the wheels, as you can see, some new tape. It's a uh, gold, black and uh, blue. Kind of like it. It's, um, yeah, a little bit more flashy, but um, it also makes you more visible. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think of this. If you like it or not. I can make them full blue, full, full gold, of course. But um, yeah, so been, have, have been busy. Um, so let's see how it goes. So the most important thing is that the computer is hooked on. You can see with, with, with the light. And then you have to put the ignition on. All the contact relay. So it's powered. The fuel pump is doing, doing fine. So you can see the bike has been running a minute, but it's cold. Um, now you should see here. There should be a lighting, just gonna restart this program as well. I have a lot of troubles with it. Um, I hope I can fix it. And these days you cannot uh, download this anymore. So if you need the program, send me, uh, ask me in the comments and I'll send you via email uh, because this one is only now available on uh, cell phones, which I found not, not practical. Yeah, made contact. As you saw in the former video, it goes from red to amber to green. So now the bike is engaged. In your diagnostics, you should see that the bike is now in 32 degrees. Yeah. Yeah. And also, if normally, if you put this one out, it doesn't work. Normally, the switch here should be uh, red. Ah, here it goes. It's a bit of a delay. Also gives an error. And that's normal because uh, the sensor is not connected. TPS is okay. I'm going to start it up and we'll see how far we go. And also here when I run the bike, yeah, it's really powerful uh, ignition, really powerful start up and the revs are really good. And this is with very, very stable with the new electronics installed. Um, the engine management light I will reset. But as you can see now, these two are not synced with this one, okay? So I'm gonna put them on to 6 600. I'm gonna start with cylinder one, and then a line two on one, and then a line two, three, 
on two. I'm just gonna, gonna flip the throttle. I see it's gonna reset. So now you have to look here on these three points. You have to uh, take a screwdriver, and if you go in, you're gonna increase the pressure. So in is increase. Just a small turn. Close to 600. It's gonna decrease because it went to 610. All right, we're gonna go to the, the second one. Give it a small, small twitch. on going until you have the sick the, the right numbers of course all right as you can see they're perfectly aligned and I'm gonna I'm gonna flip the throttle should be back and sync. Wow. So that's what you want to see. The RPM is beautiful. 1390. This is a, a very good rough. I never had this with the original uh, stator and uh, volt uh, regulator. It's really stable. So that's going to promise uh, on the throttle field what I'm going to run. It's a little bit lower as well because the temperature is now higher. Uh, as you can see, the fan is running. Just give it a second and the lights will come on. As you can see, the fan is now running. And it's on 100 degrees. Also all the sensors as well. Just gonna let's set this on 100 degrees. You can also play with the speed limits, but I think that's fine. RPM I wouldn't touch, and the speed adjuster. If you put it a little bit lower, you have uh, less trouble with the cops. Yeah? Like two uh, tenths, that will save you two kilometers an hour maybe. I think that's all good.